I'm here with Amy Vent from the YMCA. Thanks for coming on, Amy. Glad to be here. So, Amy, could you talk to us a little bit about uh, the YMCA in general and also the YMCA's connection in Reading? Sure. So the YMCA, of course, is an international organization, but here in Reading, we serve primarily our five communities, Reading, North Reading, Stoneham, Wakefield, and Wilmington, and we're open for eight, all ages, all abilities, you name it, come on in, and we've got a program for you, whether it's sports or, of course, this time of year, swimming and camp or health and wellness. Um, for seniors, we also have a number of programs for um, cancer survivors um, that are completely free, um, so f completely scholarship through different organizations. Right. So I'm, a, I'm an alumni of a, of a program through the YMCA growing up as you know, Camp Wakanda and other sort of things. Uh, where are people going to get information about these camps and programs that you have going on? So you're welcome to come into the Y, or you can go to ymcaboston.org slash Burbank, and you'll go right to our um, webpage, and you can see all our different programs. Click on the links for camps. Um, swim lessons, again, download our program guide. So all of that is available online. Now, how would someone become a member of the YMCA? So to become a member, come on in, talk to Christine Fisher or anybody at the Welcome Center, and we'll give you a tour and set you up for membership. And we've got membership for, again, all ages, all um, family groups, so two-parent family, single family, couples, seniors, you name it, we've got something that'll meet your needs. Great. And, you know, there's, a, like you said, there's a lot of programs in swimming, and as mm -hmm. the weather has started yes. to, uh, you know, get a little bit warmer, obviously yep. there's going to be a lot more people swimming. So I, I know there's a pool at, at uh, yep. the YMCA, and there's swimming lessons. Can you talk a little Correct. bit more about well, just, uh, you know, how, how can people cool off this summer with swimming? <sighs> So for swimming, we've got our regular swim lesson programs. We start as young as six months, so getting our children to be better prepared to be safe around the water and educating our parents about that program as well. We go all the way up through adult swim lessons, so again, all ages. We've got lap swim, we've got open swim, again, available for membership in our regular lap pool. So we've got the eight lane, 25 yard lap pool. So come on in and get some exercise. We've got our family swim pool, um, which is kept a little bit warmer. Don't need it as much during the summer, but 88 degrees. We also have our splash park. So if you've got children with um, young, so about that eight and under, who don't want to go swimming or maybe don't have the swimming ability, they can go out to the splash park and just splash around with some of those elements as well. Great. It's a great way to cool off during yes. the summer. Amy, anything else before, before we uh, sign off here that you want to you wanna plug? Just again, that we're really here for the community. Um, so whether or not you think you can afford it, we've got financial aid for all. Nobody's ever turned away for an inability to pay. We give away over $250,000 every year in financial aid. Um, we are a nonprofit, so we do raise money as well through our different um, annual funds. But again, it's open for everybody. And come on in and check us out. Great.